My name is Tom Cross. I'm a rocket launch photographer at Kennedy Space Center for a website called teslarati.com. I get a lot of questions about the gear I use to take the rocket launch photos. I'm going to let you guys in on a little secret today. I'm going to show you the camera trigger I use. This is the MyOps Smart Trigger. It's designed and assembled by hand in Istanbul, Turkey. They ship it from there also. You get it anywhere in the world in two days. It's a generously sized trigger. It's super lightweight, but it's very rugged. You feel like it can take a couple of drops. You don't have to be easy on it. Down the left side, you have all of your external connections covered by this piece of rubber. It slides right onto your hot shoe of your camera. There's also a female fitting here to put on a tripod or you can bolt it to something, uh, whatever you want. There's a removable battery, very big battery for this. Uh, this hardly uses any power. The battery will last a couple of days on a single charge. If you need extra batteries for some reason, they are removable. Uh, the buttons take about the same amount of effort as a computer mouse. They make a really satisfying click when you push them. Turn the device on with the power switch. It takes a little bit of effort, which is great because you're not gonna accidentally shut it off. Here's the user interface. It is super simple and it's not going to crash on you. All of the standard features come on the device. There's a lot more features on the free app that you download. For my purposes, I use the sound setting. You set your sensitivity, you set if you want to delay, you set if you want to lock it. The way you do that, left and right. Hold it down, it'll make it go faster. I love the stepper because you can figure out the number is best for your situation and set it every time without having to turn a dial and clap or blow on it or anything like that to get it to work. You figure out your number, you stick to it, and it works every time. Some triggers, they have not a lot of mic sensitivity between one and 100. This one has a wide range of sensitivity. Uh, you have to really tap on this to get it to trigger at one, and it doesn't take much to get it to fire at 99. Um, so there's a wide range so once you've set your settings, just push the start button. Sound mode is running. The mic will stay on, the device will fall asleep, the battery will last two days, it's solid. It gets way better when you have the app. So the Bluetooth has found the device, tap on it. Now it's connected. Now you have this awesome user interface. As I change the sensitivity on here, the device will update after I start it. Now it's running, push stop, now it's stopped. Go down to 25, start, sets so to 25, stop. On the bottom, my app smart can slide onto the hot shoe. Now it's on there, good and solid. They have these awesome custom cables, black and orange, really easy to find inside your bag. So on the app, you're totally hands-free. You can use it as a cable release. Just tap. One of the most convenient features of the app, it's counting the exposure time. We stop it. The signal travels pretty far over Bluetooth. Another awesome convenient feature of MyOps Smart is the ability to charge it externally with a smartphone charger. Say you forgot to charge it before you left or you're running low on battery on your current job, I uh, just plug it in and it still works while you're charging. So just after the launch, checking out the remote images. Beautiful. I love this trigger. MyOps is the best, most reliable trigger you'll ever get. All right, so that's my secret. MyOps Smart's my favorite photography trigger. A great tool to have. I use it on rocket launches. I take it on hikes with me, use it for nighttime long exposures. It's really like having an extra photographer all the time that's reliable, it's dependable, durable, it's not going to let you down. Definitely worth the money. Get one, get out there, start using it. I hope you enjoy it. I'm Tom Cross with Tesla Roddy. Have a good one.